Hi from Ardhan Gupta Toys in Pune. My name is Manish. In these summers, even our bottles can turn thirsty. Let's see our thirsty bottle. This is an extremely warm bottle. And watch closely how this bottle starts sucking water and how the water rises in the bottle. And if we pour water on top of the bottle, cold water, see if the water rises. You can see the water rising fairly quickly. We are showing this in fast forward, but it takes about a minute for the water to rise. So let's see what we need to perform this activity, a glass bottle, colored water and a plate. First take really hot boiling water and pour it in this bottle. So you have to be very careful because the water has to be really hot and boiling. Rinse the bottle and pour the water out. What we have done by this is to raise the temperature of the air inside the bottle to as much as that of the water. And we quickly place it upside down in a plate full of water. And you see the water will start rising up. And if you see, leave it for a long time, the water rises to almost a fourth of the height of the bottle. And as you will see later, we want you to find out the exact theoretical height to which the water can rise. Now what is going on? There is nothing burning here, so no oxygen is getting consumed. But when we pour water, we raise the temperature of the air. And when we place the bottle upside down, the warm air is trapped inside. When the air cools down, its volume is reduced and hence the water is sucked up to take its place. You can see children here performing this activity and having fun. Learning that volume and temperature of a fixed amount of gas is proportional. So now that our bottle has quenched its thirst, let's look and try to answer some of the questions. Let's think about these. So what would be the maximum height? to which the water will rise. You can assume that this is a straight cylindrical bottle. So what is the percentage height to which this water can rise? And if this were instead of water, if you were using oil, would it make any difference? Now as you notice, we heated the bottle with hot water. Instead, if we had kept, if we had made this bottle hot by keeping it, let's say in some uh, oven or something and raised the temperature almost equal to what it would have been with hot water, will the water rise more or less? So think about these questions and send us an email at support at or send us as comments in YouTube or Facebook. Thank you.